reaction when my mom told me she was joining the army was shock. Oh, she was in Iraq when I decided to join. It influenced me because it's something that I've always wanted to do. And I've told her over and over, you know, when you have a dream to fulfill your dream. We were deployed together. So being deployed together, we were in the same unit. She was in the S1 and I was in the S4. We went to the DFAC together. We were living in the same D-Hut. So yeah, it, it helps that bond. We can relate. That was a very unique experience. We get pretty much each other's support. She celebrated my 21st birthday over there. We cooked, well, she cooked and I ate mostly. <laughs> We did a lot of fun stuff, but one of the most enjoyable thing that we did was always being at her sports. I was her loudest cheerleader. She did track and field. I mean, parents could say, yes, her mom is in the stand. Looking back now, I'm, I'm thankful that she was the loudest because I know for a lot of parents, it's hard for them to make every single, you know, game or meet for their child. And just knowing that she was able to be there and to cheer me on as loudly as she did, sometimes a little embarrassing, but that was okay. <laughs> um, you know, that's, that's definitely a great memory. Um, and I'm thankful for that. I'm very proud of her, and I'm glad she got the opportunity to serve. She did something that many Americans have not taken the opportunity to do. I am so proud of her. I am really happy that she decided to follow her dream. You know, I brag about her all the time, post about her. Um, my family, we're all, we're all super proud of her. She's definitely the rock in our family.